Let's see how Princess Diana can teach us the divisions of the brain. Here's an interior view of the brain. This is a central nervous system consisting of the brain and spinal cord. This is the forebrain. The midbrain structures below the hindbrain. And finally, we have our spinal cord. These are the pons, medulla, and cerebellum. And as a group, they're called the hindbrain, or known as rhombencephalon. The cerebellum is R for rhombo, rear, or behind brain. Connecting the forebrain and hindbrain is the midbrain, or known as mesencephalon, MNM, mesen mid. Now the forebrain, this is known as the prosencephalon. iPhone Pro is for you. The prosencephalon is two parts. The outer part, which is the outer cerebral hemisphere, we'll call this the telencephalon, and the deeper cerebral hemisphere, we'll call the diencephalon. You see, back in the day, Princess Diana was the center of attention. She was the Princess Diane Cephalon, and she always had a lot of cameras and telescopes looking at her from all directions. Telescopes on the outside are the telencephalon looking at Princess Diana on the inside. Now, this may be the only useful thing about the royal family, don't you think? Are you learning something from our videos? Well then click the subscribe button to your right. We are releasing high yield lessons and ways for you to get ahead in class. Be sure to follow us on Instagram to take interactive quizzes and view your favorite diagrams. Nothing can stop you, but only if you believe in yourself. You got this.